A rough winter may lie ahead as health experts warn respiratory illnesses could surge in the coming months. Americans are being advised to get both the updated COVID-19 booster and the flu vaccine to maximize protection. For more on this, our chief health editor, Dr. Partha Nandy, joined us live. Dr. Nandy, is it safe to get both shots at the same time? So, Ryan, when, you know, when COVID vaccines, right, were first approved, health officials initially recommended, hey, let's wait two weeks be between the flu and the COVID-19 shots. And that's because, right, back then, COVID vaccines were new, right? So if people had symptoms, the people would know, hey, you know, which shot really their body re reacted to. But since then, there's been plenty of research that shows it's safe to get both shots at the same time. I strongly recommend that folks do get both vaccines as we could be, you know, in for a severe winter. And why I say that is because Australia's flu season, we talked about this before, which is earlier than ours, Brian, was very active and they thought they got higher than average peaks in cases. Most of these cases were caused by influenza A virus. It's called h 3 and two. Now, this trend can be very hard on older adults. However, quite a few kids this season were affected in the land down under as well. Having said that, just because Australia had a rough flu season doesn't mean we'll have the same, but we should be prepared. Okay. Isn't it the common thought that October is the best time to get the flu shot? And also, should people wait and get their COVID shot with the flu shot next month? So, right, it's a good question, right? So people should get the updated COVID-19 booster as soon as they're eligible. And when's that? That is two months after getting the first or second booster. If you're infected, like a lot of people I know were infected, you should wait three months after the infection. Getting boosted gives you much higher antibody levels, and what that does gives you more protection, uh, and that's supposed to help you last, uh, have a long-lasting protection. Now, as for the flu, activity we know typically goes between uh, peaks between December and February, but can last up until May. Studies have shown that the flu shot can wane over time, so you don't want to get it too early. I think the optimal time to get it, as was mentioned, is in October. But if you want to get it now, you still can. And everyone over the age of six months can get the vaccine. As for the timing, I want I wanted to be clear that you, that you can space them out or you can get them together. You shouldn't be afraid to get them together. It, it really boils down to when you're eligible for your updated COVID-19 booster shot. And I recommend you don't wait uh, to, to, to get them both together, meaning that you don't want to you know so wait for the COVID-19 until, until October. Get it now if you need to, unless you're someone who really does not want to make two separate appointments. Some people hate that. The main thing is to get protected with both vaccines when it works best for you. But remember, it's safe to get both at the same time. And, and Doc, you glitched a little bit as you were giving that, that timeline, so I want to reiterate it now. You can get the updated COVID-19 booster. Uh, you're eligible for that two months after getting the vaccine primary series or two months after the first or second booster, correct? That's absolutely right. And if you're right. infected with the virus, three months. Dr. Nandy, as always, thank you. Appreciate your time. Thank you, sir. And if you have a health question for the good doctor, you can email him, drnandy at askdrnandy.com or send it to us on Facebook or Twitter.